Hi there! If you watched my last video, you'll know that I'm on a mission to teach you how to draw. Yes, you! And it's not about talent, it's about learning a skill. Having sold over 21 million adult colouring books, I'm the girl who's going to show you how. Thank you so much to everyone who posted their beautiful flower drawings from my last video. You guys make my heart happy. And thanks for all your questions and comments. I read them all. My number one tip is always draw in pencil first. It's more forgiving. You can make changes and mistakes, then redraw in ink when you're happy. So here's a second tutorial for you. How to draw a flower and leaf combination. Using your pencil, draw a small circle surrounded by a larger one, like we did yesterday. We're going to draw six petals today. So imagining once again the large circle as a clock face, draw a long heart-shaped petal at 12 o'clock and 6 o'clock. Now make a little guide mark at 9 and 3 and fill the gaps with two petals, one above your guide mark and one below. Time for some leaves. Draw them as wavy V-shapes. This gives the impression they are peeping out from behind the flower. Now some vines. I draw the stem first, then little lozenge-shaped leaves. Grab a pen and go over your lines, adding inky details. A sprinkle of tiny circles and dots is a magical final touch. Wait for your ink to dry, then erase those pencil lines. Now to those colourists thinking, drawing? I don't want to draw, I want to colour. Do you guys remember that time, many years ago, before you discovered colouring? Did you have any inkling how great an impact on your creativity, stress levels, mood and general happiness colouring would have on your life? Well maybe, just maybe, this is the time before you discover your next big passion in life, drawing. The links between creativity and happiness are so well documented and we all saw that firsthand with the sudden explosion in colouring. Why not see if this simple skill can make you happier? Any questions? Post them below and I'll get back to you. In my next video, I'll show you how to put all these flowers and leaves to good use and draw something truly special. You are going to love this. So why not give it a go? Draw a flower and leaf combo, then post it with hashtag how to draw so I can find it and give you a high five. Till next time, have fun, be kind, and let's fill this world with happy artists.